You know what, Moo Moo? I think I'm getting prettier every day. I don't know if it's my cute ears or my lovely neck that makes me the most beautiful giraffe in the valley. Uh, Rita, you're the only giraffe in the valley. That's why you're the most beautiful one. Have you noticed how pretty that lion is? With his amazing mane and green eyes, strong paws and cute bottom? And those sharp teeth. Hello, Mr. Lion. Psst, psst. Hello. He'll definitely say something to me. Hi, Lion. How are you doing today? He's completely ignoring us. But he's so cute that I'm gonna go talk to him. You have the most beautiful hair. Mind if I touch it? I already know I'm handsome. My hair is perfect. My eyes are like the sun. I'm the most beautiful animal in the universe. Um, how can you two stand being so, um, strange looking? Cow, you're too spongy. Your eyes are too far apart and your nose is, is, well, I can't even describe it. And you, long creature, where do you think you're going with such a neck and that coloring? I simply don't like it at all. Moo Moo, he was so mean to us. Do you think that my eyes are too far apart and that my nose is hideous? Of course not, Moo Moo. You're a very good looking cow. You have big, gorgeous eyes and a perfect nose. Why are you asking such a strange question, Moo Moo? A little while ago, Rita and I were walking by the lake when we saw a lion. It was a gorgeous lion. He had the most beautiful mane and eyes like the sun and beautiful fangs, and very white. He must brush them every day. So we went to go talk to him, and the reality was that he had no interest in us at all. But I don't know why. He started telling us we were ugly, and that our eyes were too far apart, and I had a neck that was too long. He was full of himself. This can't stay like this. We need to show that lion that he needs to treat everyone with respect and that it's wrong to say rude things about others. I've got it. Why don't we make him think he's a really ugly lion? That way, he'll learn that he can't go around making others feel bad. And how are we going to make that lion think he's ugly? Why don't we dress Alfred up as a lion and make him look really ugly? Yeah, yeah let's, let's do, do it! it. I'm sorry, but I don't intend on dressing up as anything. Come on, Alfred. Do it for the team. Well, don't count on me. Alfred, you look awesome. You need to go behind the waterfall. So when the lion sees his reflection, he'll think he's hideous. And the rest of us will hide so the lion won't see us. Let's do a trial run, Alfred. When I look at myself in the water, get closer. Ready? One, two, three. That's great, Alfred. I'm sure this lion's going to have quite a scare. I'm so handsome. I'm so good looking. I'm so ugly. I'm handsome, I'm handsome. This can't be happening to me. All of a sudden I'm ugly. I must be hallucinating. was great. Did you see the look on that arrogant lion's face? Milo, poor Mr. Lion. He's all upset now. We've got to go tell him the truth. Let's go, Moo Moo. We've got a lion to tame. Hello, Mr. Lion. I know you don't like me because of the ugly things I said to you before. 
I've always made fun of everyone, but now I'm like everyone else. Actually, Mr. Lion, you're still just as handsome as you've always been. And if you don't believe us, go take another look at your reflection in the water. I don't dare. I can't bear to look at that ugly face again. Go on, you may be handsome, but you're a coward. Look at yourself already. I'm still handsome! Thank you, girls. You've really cheered me up. I'm sorry for everything I said earlier. The truth is, I think you're both very pretty. <laughs> the lion has learned a very valuable lesson, that we all have beautiful qualities. Alfred uses few words, but says a lot. Milo has great ideas. Talala is clever. Mumu is so nice. And Olga is very pretty. And I'm the best of us all. <laughs> <laughs> We have to plant all these seeds. Luckily, with all of us helping, it shouldn't take too long. What do you want us to plant this year? I really like tomatoes, but I also like oranges and melons, and I also like watermelons and giant pumpkins and... Mumu, we don't have enough room to plant so many things. You have to choose just one. Tomatoes. Very good, tomatoes. What else, Alfred? I really like carrots a lot. And lettuce, Talalo. Well, what I really like are sausages. I like sausages too, but we can't plant them. Why can't we plant them? Everybody got to choose something to plant, and I didn't say anything. I want to plant sausages. Rita, sausages are neither fruits nor vegetables. We can't plant them. I know perfectly well that sausages can be planted, and I'm going to demonstrate. While Rita plants sausages, we're going to plant seeds. Mumu, you plant the tomato seeds. Alfred, you put in the carrot seeds. Talalo, you put in the lettuce seeds, and I'll plant the pumpkin seeds. You, Milo, you can plant the potatoes. Now, let's all get to work. Olga, how long does it take to grow tomatoes? Well, it takes about five or six months for them to grow and be ready to eat. I thought that tomatoes were grown in the supermarket, in their little containers, in their little rows, all neat and organized. Yes, Mumu, tomatoes are sold in the supermarket, but first somebody has to plant them like you're doing now. Then they need to be watered for many months, and they need to get a lot of sun, and only then will they grow into delicious, ready-to-eat tomatoes. And... How long will Rita's sausages take to grow? When they see how these sausages grow, they're going to realize their big mistake. I'll put one sausage here and another here. This one looks so good, then I'm gonna eat it. Nom, 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 nom. That was really good. Now I'm a little hungry. I can eat another one since I still have a lot left. I'm going to keep on planting sausages. Another here, and another here. Now I only need to wait about 10 minutes. Yum, 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 yum. Hello, Rita. Have you already planted your sausages? Yes, I've already planted all these. And do you really think they're going to grow? Well, of course, Momo. Soon we'll have the same but a whole lot bigger. That's how large sausages are made. Ah. May I eat one? They just look so good. All right, Moo Moo, but just one. While you're there, could you get one for me as well? It's amazing how much I like sausages. 
Well, I really like tomatoes, but they take so long to grow that I don't know if I'll be able to wait five months without tasting them. You have to wait five months? Yes. How long do you think it'll take for your super sausages to grow? Well, I don't know, but I was thinking five minutes. But if we have to wait so long, we might as well eat them now, right? Rita, you're hungry, aren't you? So catch this one and eat it. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. This one is so good. Now I'll throw you one. Yum, 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 yum. Throw me another one. Now you to me. Yum, 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 yum. I don't have any sausages left. Now what am I going to tell Olga when she sees I didn't plant anything? Rita, did you really believe that if you planted sausages in the ground, they'd grow? Now that you mention it, it's possible that there's a slim possibility that they wouldn't. But since Olga's always right, I had to contradict her. When Olga comes, just tell her that you made a mistake and that you didn't want to plant sausages. Tell her that you wanted to plant zucchini. Those will definitely grow if you plant them. Hi, Rita. Hi, Moo Moo. We've already planted everything in the vegetable garden. Tomorrow we need to go and water them. What's wrong, Rita? Why are you looking at me like that? I'm not looking at you in any way. It's my way of looking. Rita? Is something wrong? I thought you were going to plant sausages. The truth is that I did plant them. But we were so hungry that Moo Moo and I ate them all. It's true, they were really good. But Olga, I already knew that sausages don't grow on the ground. Don't think that I'm not as clever as you are. Come on, Moo Moo, let's go. We need to plant a uh, zucchini. Milo, what are zucconis? In Rita's world, there's something like zucchini, 